The Dominican government announced on Monday night its intention to establish diplomatic relations with the People's Republic of China. The chief legal counsel to the Dominican president, Flavio Dario Espinal, explained that the decision was made with the belief that this relationship will be positive for the country. Con este objetivo, el canciller de la República, Miguel Vargas Maldonado, y el ministro administrativo de la presidencia, José Ramón Peralta, se encuentran hoy en Beijing para firmar un comunicado conjunto en el que se establecen las relaciones diplomáticas entre nuestros países. He affirmed that relations between China and the Caribbean nation will be officially announced at a public ceremony currently taking place in the Chinese capital. Por nuestra parte, la decisión de dar este paso ha sido largamente meditada y consultada con amplios sectores políticos y económicos del país, tomando en cuenta principalmente las necesidades, potencialidades y perspectivas de futuro para el pueblo dominicano. The official said that for years the Dominican productive sectors have necessitated a greater diplomatic, commercial and economic connection with the People's Republic of China. China es hoy la segunda economía global y su base manufacturera exportadora es líder mundial. Tiene el sistema bancario con mayores depósitos del mundo. Su población es el consumidor con una demanda más creciente de productos y su territorio es tanto el destino como el origen de algunas de las empresas más innovadoras en terrenos que van desde la inteligencia artificial a las ciencias de la salud. Although China and the Dominican Republic did not previously have diplomatic relations, bilateral trade has grown to the point that China is the second biggest buyer of Dominican products, with an annual trade exchange of around $2 billion. The Dominican Council said that in the near future, enormous opportunities for cooperation will gradually open up between the two countries, not only in the field of trade, but also in fields like finance, technology and tourism.